Welcome back fellow coders, Jared O'Leary here with Boot Up. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create a restart function for a maze game. So right now I've got it so that my code will make my uh, character move around on the screen when I press green flag and use the arrow keys. That's great, but I wanna make it so that every time I either touch wall or touch the um, goal that the cat restarts as well as every time I press a green flag, restarts to the same location. So because this is a code that's gonna be used for three different things, when the green flag is clicked, when you touch a wall, when you uh, touch the goal, we're going to create a function. So to do that, we're going to actually create a new block. So under the my blocks, we're gonna go say make it block, and we'll give it a name, something like restart. So this is the name for a function. There's some other cool stuff you can do with this, but we're not gonna use these in the um, current uh, video or project. So this creates a new define block. And in this define block, we're going to use uh, a set of code. And the code is simply going to be to restart to the bottom left corner. So we drag our sprite to where you want it to restart to, and then you simply use a go to block. Now, if we go to my blocks, there's a new block here called restart. Every time we use this block, it's going to run whatever code is attached to the define. And in this case, it's only one block. So what we're gonna do to restart when we do the green flag is we're going to attach it right up here. So we uh, click the green flag, it's going to set the size, and then it's going to restart the uh, sprite to the correct location. So I press the green flag and restarts to the correct location. Now we're gonna use this block in other videos that you're going to watch um, for the wall and for the goal. So stay tuned for that. Hey everyone, if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not watching us on YouTube, you can find us on that platform as well as other social media outlets by searching for Boot Up PD. And if you're looking for more free lessons, projects, and resources for teachers and students, visit us at bootuppd.org, where you can also learn about our high-quality professional development.